Donald Trump is refusing to scrap the ban on people from seven mainly Muslim countries traveling to the U.S. despite worldwide protests. Our chief correspondent Richard Gaysford is at JFK Airport in New York for us this morning. And Richard, there's been some news for British travelers on this. <coughs> Yes, Boris Johnson, the Foreign Secretary, Charlotte, saying that dual nationals who are flying from the UK to the US will be able to come into America without any problems. The same can't be said for many others, though, and that is why lawyers are camped out here in the terminal at JFK, and it's a similar picture across the nation. They're here to help those who are struggling to get in, to give advice to the relatives who are waiting for people to come through who just don't appear. And protests really are growing about this travel ban. We've seen it here in New York and across the country. People really angry at it. They feel it's not American and that it's counterproductive, that it won't help improve security and will make Americans more of a target.